Hey guys, you know what time it is? It's time for another YouTube video. Okay, I have more excited. This one is very impressive. Well, I hope you are excited because today I will be doing a makeup tutorial. And now, I know this is very important with lots of bolts going on at the moment, and you want to be prepared, prepared. So this is a bit of an extravagant look. If you want to go all out, you want everyone talking about your makeup look, okay? This is the one to go for. Just gonna check your hair up in a wee, a wee bit. It's, it's the way to go, you know? It's the way to go. And yeah, it's definitely the vibe. So yeah, now you've got your hair up, you can get started. The next step, you wanna chuck in some little clips, hold those little flyaways in, okay? This is an important part too. Cheeky little plait there. There we go, now we're ready. The hair is ready. Okay, got my little chair. There we go. Okay, so this is my first step. I've cleansed my face. Make sure your face is clean, people. You don't want to have a breakout. This is a lovely moisturizer. Um, you want to apply plenty of moisturizer to your face. And that is a lovely step. Okay, now that you've applied your moisturizer, nice and rubbed in, then you're really oh, pretty much ready with your base. This is a lovely one to use. You, you want to go for it, push your eyebrows nice and up. Yes, gorgeous, that's how we like them. Um, as you can see, I've already got my earrings in. Make sure you've got your jewelry on and your dress if you're getting ready for the fall. Um, this is my ball outfit. I know it seems a little bit casual, but I'm kind of going for that casual, trendy look, you know. So, you know, and, um, next, we want to apply our, we're going to start with our eyes, and we're going to start with this beautiful palette by Jeffree Star. It's a little bit cancelled, so <clears throat> we're not going to go there. That's just all we have for now. We're gonna apply with the um, eyeshadow, but we kind of use eyeshadow for everything. So I really want you to go with the Vroom Vroom for a lovely contour look. Just gonna lick your finger in there and go like this. Lovely, that's quite a lovely application process. So you've got that. And you wanna put a little bit on the sides of your nose. If you want to have that lovely, elegant, skinny nose look, which isn't everyone's go-to, but it is for me today. Just, that's the vibe for today. And next, we are going to get some blush called Don't Know Her. It's quite a cutie. Look at that beautiful color. Anyway, we're going to put some blush on there. And then we're going to lose some lip for the shiny tones, a little bit of lightness there, and there, and then we're going to use Welcome for a little bit of gorgeous shine. So now you're kind of ready, we want to blend that all in, so we give it a little bit of a rub. And look at that, it's really coming along. So this is just like a kind of easy do it at home kind of thing, if you run a bit of a rash, and kind of, look how it turned out, like, and glowing, I've got beautiful, beautiful definition on my face, now we're moving on to the eyes, um, we're gonna go for some custom rims, which is this beautiful shiny silver down in the corner, we're gonna go there, just wanna dab that on the inside there, Gorgeous, gives you some beautiful highlight, really opens your eyes up. Do you like it? Thank you, yes. So now I'm going for pinky tone. Just want to bring in the pink of the rims of my pe they're not peaches. <clears throat> Sorry, my beautiful, beautiful soup. And um we're gonna use this pink fleet. For the bottom of my eyelids down here. See, don't you think that brings out my eyes? Thank you, I do too. 
and we're gonna do it on the other side. This is a little bit of a cheeky one, but if you really want to be a bit spicy, then you're gonna do that. Okay, now we're gonna go for, I'm thinking some mango. It's a bit darker, and we're gonna make the edges a little bit darker. Love, I'm, oh, I'm loving that. That's a lovely rosy tone. Oh, gorgeous. So now I've kind of made your pink eyes. You want to get a bit of a different color. So we're going to go for some night, which is this lovely green one. And we're going to go up the top. If you didn't know, I love watermelon on the fruit. I like my bracelet. And... I just wanted to bring that in. So some more for the other side. And yes. Oh, I'm loving it. So I think I'm like very elegant, a bit spicy with the sun. So I'm loving the look. Look, I can just look at myself in the mirror. Ah, oh, that's how I want to look. I'm very excited for this look. Now I'm gonna do a quick rinse with my fingers. And, um, get on to the next step. So, the next step, I'm going to give you a really good, really good, really good five-minute craft technique. You will never go back once you start this. This is for lip gloss application. If you're clumsy like me and you often get lipstick on your lips, I mean, on your teeth, you got to try this. You just put your hockey mouth guy like this. And then you can start your application. Okay, we're going for a bit of a nude tone. It's called Peach because we're gonna apply this and then put some um of our eyeshadow onto our lips. So that's just the way to go. You want to be nice and generous. Mm, it's got such a lovely smell. Look, it's just such great chocolate. Oh look, see that would be my teeth. Mm. And then you rub them together, and then you're pretty much like ready for your eyeshadow application onto your lips. Like this, this is life changing. You'll never go back. So we want to bring in some of the same colors. So we're gonna go for maybe some self-made because that's a little bit different shade. It's just a lovely look in there. Mm. That's quite cute. Might get some, don't know her. Mm. We love those beautiful red lips. And we want to have a little bit of shine in the middle. Oh, oh my god, I look like a new person. Okay, now that my lips are done, I think I might just go add a little bit more contour. So that's back with the vroom vroom. A little more on there. Oh yeah, that's better. And up up here, we wanted a little bit of definition of my forehead. I just think that that's quite an important step because it just like, you know, it just brings it together a little bit more. Now you can remove your mouth guard <laughs> and look, nothing on IT. Now we're gonna go for a wash of the fingers again. And then we're on to the mascara and eyebrows, which is our final stages. So, yeah, um, I'm quite excited. This is a bit of a cheeky one. I didn't quite use this, but I've been using this in the leading up. This is a really, really good. It makes your lips nice and plump like this. And I'm ready to go. So, you can be a little bit cheeky too. Just, you know, it's a one time. It's for your ball. You gotta, you gotta live it up, you know? Um, we are just going to find our cheeky mascara in here somewhere. Where has she gone? There she is. I've got two different mascaras. So these are my two ones. This one is Revlon Volume and Length Magnified, which, oh my god, that was my original. But this is my Two Fades Better Than Fades, which I'm going to give it a go today. <coughs> Sorry, might be a little cold. Hopefully it's better by the ball tonight. So this is a little fun fact. You can also use this for your eyebrows. So we're gonna start by curling our eyelashes because I almost forgot that. 
you want to get your eyelash curler and you want to just go like this, okay? And give it a little squeeze up there. And now your eyelash is a nice and curled. Now you want to do that to the other side. This is a bit of a scary thing for me to do. Gorgeous. Now they're curled. You'll really see the definition of this um, mascara. So you want to go and apply the old mascara. It's a bit of tricky. Don't you think that looks gorgeous? And then you want to do the cheeky little bottoms. They're real hard to do sometimes. And then look at, the, look at the definition of your eye there. Don't you think that's so gorgeous? And then you want to do the other side. It's really tricky. Oh my goodness. This is really coming along now. Um... Oh, I almost got some in my eye there, guys. Um, please don't mind the talking in the background. It's my parents. But, yeah. Oh, shoot me timbers. That's all right. We can use that as a little bit more contour. Oh, that's really coming through. I'm liking it. Perfect. So now your eyelashes are done. They're nice and gorgeous. You want to go and get your moisture and... And do your eyeshadow, I mean eye mascara, just give your eyebrows a little bit of a, a brush, just nice and gently. See them really coming through like that? It's really gorgeous. Um, I'm loving the look. So yeah, basically, if you want to come to the ball with me, you really got to step it up and have a um, lovely outfit like this. Um, and if you're lucky enough, I will add in my final look for the ball with me in my dress and everything. Um, yeah. So, basically, so far, this is my final look. Do I think I just pop? Everyone will be looking at me with this. So if you want to be a little bit pricey, a little bit cheeky, you want a final look like this, please follow my tutorial, like and subscribe, and you will be a baddie. You will be a back of sassy, <laughs> a back of sassy baddie slay queen. And I really, really hope you do. Because who wouldn't want to look gorgeous like this? Thank you. I love you guys.